What makes you want to have a fan? I wish I had a fan <laughs> today. We do, you just don't have one in your hands. I know. I Where's have one. It's, it's stuck. But they have different fans on the logos, which actually, because um, this is a fan collection box, I think it could be a fan collection set, right? For the different. Oh my gosh! Okay, a different fan for each property. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Excuse me. Okay, I get excited. Wouldn't that be cool? Dude, a collector's items. A fan for each property indicative of the area. Okay, excuse me. I get a little bit excited. We're taking fans for two reasons. One is because I it was able to go to a press event yesterday with the Mandarin Oriental, whose logo happens to be a fan. And of course, I'm a big fan of Mandarin Oriental because it's you know, it's a luxury property and it's gorgeous and each of them has their own unique destination. But also because we were under a heat warning. They're saying it is for Los Angeles. Yes. Actually, California, Arizona, Nevada. And I think there's some other states too. But we're under a heat warning. So I don't know about you, but I think it's time to go to the beach. Well, for now, we're going to bring old Camel with comments on the headlines of today. Um, and it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, absolutely, because uh, they're going to—they're not going to get the love they wanted from the Democrats, and the and the Latinos aren't going to vote for them because the House is not going. Okay, they have told Bonnier if he supports the Senate's plan or gives the people or doesn't do make certain that uh, the, the security is done first on the border. And then the other thing, they're going to kick his ass out of, not just out of the sponsorship. They said he will not survive beyond November. Mm -hmm. They will remove him in a row, in a, in a no, and no, they're already got the petition out to remove him because they said that, uh, I have this one of the people said from, uh, one of the conservatives said, the president, every time the president comes to, um, uh, come to uh, Ohio, he makes certain that uh, Binder comes and kisses his butt in mm -hmm. order to make certain that the binder stays in line. But then we also have to make it. We're not, today we're not using my Monty's family because I have a present from Monty and her mommy. And you notice my cell phone is pink. <laughs> uh, you also notice one other major thing about my pink cell phone. It also has Monty's mommy's uh, information on it. And Monty's mommy broke hers just like this one. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> So, you think that there might be a message in a pink cell phone with all of the not a spring chicks info on it. Oh. Yeah, like, Give me a hint. And White House expects Russia to look at all options to expel Snowden back. Well, uh, there's no reason for him to come back because um, he's li he can live a comfortable life. Uh, okay, he's free to go anywhere he wants to in the Soviet Union as long as he's back at night in the transition center. And uh, and it's not going to cost him anything because they'll bill it to they, they'll bill it to Barack Obama because Obama people were the stupid ones that took his passport away and they can't give it back to him <laughs> because they that what happened was they uh, what generally they do is they take it and they shred it so it can't be used he cannot leave the country we do not okay we uh, they, there are no American diplomatic military flights into the Soviet Union and that's what he would have to come back on and any kind of happen. Mm -hmm. And Erdogan defends riot police tactics in Turkey protests. Oh no, I mean, the guy is an idiot because the, um, he's gone there, okay, this country was filmed by, created, the modern Turkey was created by Ataturk who was thought that they were, they were going to too traditional Muslim and he wanted to be part of the modern world. So what's happening is is that a lot of the young Turks, it's not the older ones, it is the young Turks, like the idea of pushing women around and being at the top of the food chain. They don't want women driving, they don't want people working. They want women following behind them and have as many wives as they choose and not actually get married. And that appeals to young Muslims. And the fact that they can go, uh, that basically when you do business with infidels, you can basically lie through your teeth to them because it's not a lie to do uh, to uh, rely to an infantile. That's just considered to be acceptable. Mm. And Mandela's health worsens and conditions now critical. Well, you know, well, he's like, you, you know, I know he's, he's, I think, 14 years older than I am, and I'm how bad a shape I'm in. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I'm in real bad shape, folks. Yeah, I was going to say. I know, real bad shape. <laughs> he's in real bad shape. <laughs> bad shape. 
And Syrian rebels renew fight for Aleppo. Aleppo? Yeah, they, what is Aleppo? Oh, it's another one of these cities that they, that was one of their strongholds they got kicked out of. The, the, I said the war is over. Obama is coming in when the war is over. Assad won the war because Obama didn't do anything. All he had to do was when the good guys were fighting, was to send them the small weapons they needed and they could have won because the Russians weren't that deeply involved. Now the Russians are going to love this, you know. Hey, I know you. I've known you for 20 years. Aren't you an admiral? No, I'm just a private citizen now. Yeah, yeah. They, they took their uniforms off. The military is everywhere in Syria, but they no longer have uniforms on, folks. Mm. That's how deeply they're involved in keeping them in control now. And Senate passes immigration overhaul bill. Which is the most ridiculous thing on the face of this planet. Uh, here's the trick is, two of the main sponsors of this stupid bill did not show up at the press conference yesterday. Mm -hmm. they, did, they refused to go to the press conference because they, uh, okay, they've already been told, uh, Rubio, he said he not only kissed his president ambitions goodbye, they are uh, basically getting ready to hold a recall election on him now, and they expect that he will lose his Senate seat. And, ooh, guess who also didn't show up? Coker, who basically created this thing, you know, uh, which is basically this grand plan to hire 100%, uh, I mean, it's 200% more Border patrolmen than they currently have, 20,000, which is never going to happen. They also have got a recall petition, which also, like Rubio, filled out the first day they put it out. These mm -hmm. guys are gone. They said that Corker, um, okay, Corker was, a, they said he came from the House of Representatives to the Senate at, in 210, and he's gone because he got the, it's this, you know, it's not like they got a lot of Latinos in his community. Mm. But he, we, he, we did something for the ages, and he wouldn't even show up at the press conference to support what he did, because uh, he never read it. They asked him the day before, can you tell us what's in it? Well, I, you know, we didn't actually write it, oh, mm -hmm. because the president's people wrote it. And White House doesn't have figure on cost of Africa trip. Well, it's, over, it's now between 120 and 240 million dollars. It's ridiculous. Well, the Secret Service, that, you know, the same Secret Service that said it was going to cost too much money to have the White House tours, is spending more money than the White House tours, uh, was it, they said every hour they spend more money than the, tour, the tours were costing to have him and his family vacation. That's what it is, folks. And Fed's Boston Marathon suspect had bomb making instructions, jihad literature. Oh, but they didn't charge him with, uh, with terrorism. They charged him with, uh, with illegally possessing, uh, killing four people and the illegal possession of explosives. Because I hate to tell you this, I can go make a bomb. Mm -hmm. My nephews can go make a bomb. Any kid that grew up on a, okay, I, I grew up in Culver City. Uh, we're on a farm, you know, a truck farm there, which is like five acres of ground. And every Fourth of July, we go over and blow camp. We go blow things up because you just—it it was a real simple. If you live on a farm, you know how to blow one can out of another can. Mm -hmm. We didn't have to have bottle rockets. We just shoot a can in the you know, hundred foot in the air. <laughs> and square root scientists say plants are good at math. What? No, yeah, that's right. That's yeah. just the way it is anymore. Okay, I, I, I okay, this thing. This is what amazes me, is that you have people that cannot read or write the text of people. I cannot understand how they do it. I know they use sign, they do like sign language, like, you know, uh, you or whatever, but they've got to figure out what the hell the you is and where it's at on the keyboard. They can't read or write. So how do Don't they do it? Don't ask me. In fact, just to make it a little... <laughs> yeah, and what happens is if you text too much, you find yourself writing like that. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I, I don't take much. Actually, the, the neat thing about this, my, my, my Galaxy Note, is it actually has a spell checker. <laughs> oh, the spell checker is on that is great. It's yeah. very intuitive. It doesn't let me screw up anymore. And, oh, and it's a big keyboard. <laughs> yeah, great. Oh, it's a big thing. I, I, but, you know, it's really stuff with all kinds of photo programs for her and all kinds of everything that you can think of. It's really nice. I mean, she's told me, I didn't realize it was pink. So what's the other part of the it? The other part, okay, the, there's a shell that goes around this part of the pink. It's still pink. You, you know, you could, I, you could, I checked it on the internet. It, it looked pink to me. 
Okay, fine. But my, you know, she, my, I, I, I'll I, trade you. You know, Monty was very nice. She, she, you know, she gave me this, and and okay, wait, Monty is one of my kids. You know how you know that it's a real important gift from your kids? It only cost you X amount of dollars. <laughs> Square roots. It's not, oh, she likes that one. Of course, because it is funny. Okay, retired general target of Stuxnet leaks investigation. Uh, what it amounts to is that there's nobody in the military that likes this president. No one. I mean, first of all, he's retired. You can't bust a four-star general. I mean, this is a general of the army, and you are not going to give him fits because if you give him fits, he also knows where all the bodies are buried. A three-star general. You know, there's lots of them, but a four-star is very important, and I think he probably was retired by Obama because uh, it's just like I don't. I have an invitation to go to the last two inaugurals because I didn't agree with the Bush's military thing, and uh, and I don't agree with the president's way of doing things either. So I'm basically on everybody's estimate as mm. she knows. So she wanted to go, and I wouldn't go spend the money for uniforms. I would love to have gone. It kind of cost me, what was it, $3,000 for a bloody uniform, set of uniforms. And... Oh, oh, well, we got busy doing it. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. I, I, I like this one. When any time Republicans and Democrats agree on any piece of legislation, you know there's something wrong with it. <laughs>